right, so this is our typical bed bug job. As you can see, we're set at 135 and we are maintaining 135. This is a vacant house, nobody lives here right now. Makes it a lot easier for us to guarantee the job. It's well, 135 in this bedroom. Replace sensors, these little orange guys right here. In closets, on opposite sides of the room. We use these fans to force the air into places that these heaters cannot do on their own, like bathrooms or closets as well. We have a steady temperature throughout the entire house, averaging, I'd say, around 132 degrees. This here is our repeater. What this does is communicate from our sensors to our computer out in the trailer. It lets us know down to the tenth of a degree what every one of these sensors says throughout the house. Laundry room, another sensor. We come into the master, we have two heaters in here because not only do we have to heat the space in the master bedroom, which is normally a larger bedroom, we also have to heat master bathroom, another sensor, and this closet's a little different from what we're normally used to, it actually connects, but we have another sensor here, reading temperatures again, here on this side, with a fan blowing in, and this is the other side of the bathroom in the master, there's that first sensor in the bathroom, one more fan pulling in, this heat coming directly from this heater, down in there as well. Again, 134, max out at 135. Yet another sensor and a fan directing this hot air everywhere. What we'll do is we'll walk outside now. As you can see, this is our jumble of power cables. These cables here at the end run out to our trailer, which is outside where our diesel motor and our generator are powering all this equipment. Each one of these cables runs to each one of our heaters. As you can see, there's four on this side two on this side running to that direction and down the hallway to these other heaters. We'll take a look outside of the computer. We'll run them from the window as we tape it up and seal it all the way down to the sidewalk. Into our unit where our control panel is for the entire job. We'll take a look inside our trailer for today. This is what we're looking at. This is how we monitor everything we do. Down to the tenth of a degree. As you can see we only have one that's a little bit low, but still at 118 degrees we're killing all life stages of bugs. So right now we're about 11 degrees over what we actually need. We log for four hours. At this point in time we're at two hours and 45 minutes. We have a little over an hour and 15 minutes left to go. That's our basic bed bug job.